What's going on everybody? It is your boy Gallonman20 and welcome back to another tutorial. In today's video we are going to be talking about American Truck Simulator multiplayer. A lot of people are uh, asking that question on how to get it. I was watching a live stream yesterday and uh, yeah Northern Alex he was uh, on multiplayer with a couple people in playing so I asked how to do it. Of course, I didn't get a response, so I checked different forums and everything else, and I finally figured out how to do it. So today, I'm going to make a video on how to do it instead of you guys having to go through the forums and reading everything like that. So what you guys are going to do is go to the top and type in truckersmp.com. Click enter, of course. Um, Next, what you are going to do is you're going to see this, hopefully, um, then you're going to scroll down, right here, it's right down here and it says get the mod. Click download now. Then you're going to see this. Now before you download, make sure you have current versions of either ETS2, if you decide to go with that, or ATS, which it should be already updated if you have it set to automatically update for you but then you're going to do is click download I already downloaded it so I'm going to go to my downloads and it's going to go to client here so I already have it downloaded but I can still do it again it's not going to do anything so I'm good because <clears throat> there's a the folder that you need at the very end so you're just going to click yes, OK, next, I accept, keep this the same, don't change anything there, and then this. You're going to have ETS2 multiplayer and ATS2 or ATS multiplayer checked. So depending on what you want to do, what you want to have set, I just have ATS checked. Um, because that's the one I want to download. So I did. Basically, it's custom. Um, so basically, you can go there, there, doesn't matter. And you're going to click next. This should already be the same, but if it's not, just go to um, browse, go to program files 86, Steam, Steam apps, common, and then American Truck Simulator, and then just leave it like that. Don't press anything else. Then, okay. This. You can keep the same. And I would recommend doing a desktop item icon if you guys want to. Um, but I didn't. So that's why there's a folder there. So then you click next. And basically you install it. So if you did the desktop item or icon, you will have an icon like this um, on your um, desktop. But if you didn't do the desktop item, uh, icon, you will go to where it downloaded. So um, I forget where it downloaded specifically. Um, let's go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, American Tech Simulator. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. So I forget where I found it. Um, if so, if I do find it, I'll put it in the comments. That way, anybody who's looking for that solution can actually find the folder, or you can just basically type in Truckers MP. Um, but basically, what you do, click on that or the icon that you have for the desktop item icon. So then you come in here and just press press launcher ATS MP so I'm gonna do that and I would recommend it's, it's gonna pop up with this screen it says play American Truck Simulator multiplayer or launch with DirectX I do recommend doing this with the DirectX because you get better frame rates so you need to just come you can disable this too if you don't want the window to come up and just launch it every time with that but you're gonna press play
Okay guys, now once you guys have it loaded up, all you're going to do is type in your credentials, like your email and your password. Then what you guys are going to do is go down to the different servers. There is Europe 1, 2, and 3 showing how many people are in the lobby. And even though this is an alpha version, as it states down below, um, it does have some major bugs. It might. Um, but all you're going to do is click play. And you're going to select the account that you guys would like to um, basically go into. I usually pick the one that has my max, so the one that's level 4 right now, which is the one used for live streaming. Then what you guys are going to do is if you guys are already active on a job or you want to activate a job, go ahead and do that now or whenever. Or you can just simply click drive. Now I'm already active on a job, so it's going to show I'm on it and where my last location is. And in the bottom left hand corner is going to show that you're connecting or you already are connected. So basically I'm just going to drive down the road, show you guys everything. <clears throat> um, there are no cars. It's just all the people that are online. So the good thing about it is 2,000 trucks going around un unhitched or hitched, it doesn't matter, um, driving on the road. And people are doing jobs or people are just doing, I guess, convoys, whatever. Um, but yeah. So we're going to stop right here, and I guess we're just going to go to the right, since uh, that's where our GPS is telling us. But that is another guy online, as you saw right there. He's doing another job. Um, we're just going to go over here to the right-hand side and pull over. Um, I'm not going to do a whole video on just the trucking multiplayer. This was just a tutorial on showing you guys how to do it. Um, but anyways, if you guys wanted to enjoy this video, definitely give the video a thumbs up. And also, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe as I try and post daily content. And I always try and help you guys out with tutorials on stuff you guys may or may not know. Um, anyways, that's why I'm going to leave it now. Um, and I will see you guys next time.